I absolutely adore Billy's Balloon. This is a 1998 short film directed by John Hertzfeld. And the drawing design kind of reminds me of Tim Burton's style. Not for a second that I'm saying that John Hertzfeld has tried to emulate Burton's style, but the character design is quite similar. So that appealed to me straight away. The subject matter I loved. And it's about this little boy we presume called Billy, and he's holding on to a balloon. And the next thing we know, this balloon, everything is black and white, except for the balloons. The balloons are all lovely bright colours, very attractive. I love the choice of the blood red. It works very, very well. And the next thing we know, this balloon takes on a life of its own and begins to hit Billy on the head, which I love. And things get interesting and the balloon seems to take hold and definitely has control of this child and there are other balloons involved and it gets progressively worse for Billy and I absolutely loved it and you know when I watched it I thought this is exactly the kind of thing I would create if I could draw I definitely can't but if I could this would some be something towards which I would gravitate it's completely my style and when I watched it you know, sometimes I will watch an animation and instantly my brain will begin to analyse it and pick it apart and try and work out what the messages are. And then there are ones like this where, I, where because it's the kind of image that I would love to create, I just kind of thought, yeah, this is fun. This is wacky and a little bit questionable and I love it. And I didn't, my brain just didn't try to analyse it. And to be honest, it still isn't. But it's on YouTube, and if you read the comments, there are certainly some interesting ones. Um, there is a comment quite near the top that says that it could be a commentary on what a child feels like if they're emotionally neglected by their parents, which, yes, I can see that reading. But there are quite a few comments that are just saying, you know, there is no meaning to this. It is just about what would happen if balloons sought vengeance on children and took over. And that's my favourite reading. Because while I usually prefer animations to have messages and meanings behind them so I can understand where the artist was coming from, things like this, because it speaks to me on the very surface level, I just love it for what it is. However, I would love to know, I'd love to ask the director if there was any meaning, if they did have a deeper you know, concept they were trying to represent, or if they just wanted to write a fun short or illustrate a fun short about a balloon that attacks a child because it's brilliant. Really thoroughly enjoyed it. Definitely check it out if you like quirky animation and you know I'll watch it again. I definitely will. Really thoroughly enjoyed it.